explosive. Like I feel like everyone like can go out to eat together and, and there'd be like no problems. I just feel like that kind of goes and plays into the football field. Like I feel like we trust trust one each other, one another very well. And I feel like we have the playmakers to make a lot of plays, not even just in the run game. Like I feel like we have a bunch of different receivers that can go out, get the ball, run after the catch. So I'm excited to see what happens. Was there a significance to the number change? Sorry for you to ask. Uh, no, I actually haven't. And, and not, not really. I mean, Dean uh, switched to six and he asked me if he could keep six because, I mean, six didn't have any. It, I, I didn't have anything to six. So, you know, <laughs> one was available and I was just like, why, why not? The rehab process for you, how did you kind of stay positive going through something like that? Uh, it was definitely difficult in the beginning, especially watching games. Uh, but I also feel like it is a part of the journey. Like, I, I feel like, you know, last year I was kind of having like ideas of maybe, you know, if I had ended up having the year one and maybe I was going to leave and, you know, test out the draft. And I feel like this year I kind of got in touch with my the ACL recovery kind of like made me um, really get in touch with my body. Like I, the rehab, like it makes you like kind of start over with like everything, not just like your lower body, like upper body as well. So like in a re in a really weird way, it was like a positive. And that's how I kind of looked at it. And you 100% healthy, right? Yeah. Everything's back to normal. Like... I feel great. Just the way it ended with you guys, I mean, like there's a, again, it's been Minnesota. Is that a little motivation that we got to get the, we need to get the Big Ten West back? Absolutely. You know, I just, and that, that was one of the reasons why, like, that was very difficult for me to watch at home. Uh, just sitting on the couch, you know, watching the guys go, go to battle and, like, me not being able to, um, to do anything, it was really difficult for me to kind of wrap my head around, and that's something I really don't want to happen. Braylon had an Instagram post of you and him and Isaac, and then, you know, the three, you know, legends here. Yeah. And is that, you know, something that you guys want to achieve? Or he said that you wanted to be better than those three. Is right. that, does that drive you guys? Absolutely. I, f I feel like that also goes hand in hand just coming to the school. Like, I feel like that tradition is, it, it, it's installed with coming here. So, like, obviously you want to be like those guys, but you want to be better than them because, like, they paved the way for us. So. How much further along do you think you are compared to last year, you know, heading into fall camp? Yeah, uh, last year, like I, like I said, um, I came into fall camp with some hamstring issues, and now I don't. Like, I feel great uh, overall, not even just ACL. Like, my body as a whole, it feels great. How excited are you to get this thing going? I know that, you know, it's a, it's a dumb question, but that, those are the kind of questions I ask. <laughs> no, nah, it's not a dumb question. I feel like I haven't played football in a long time, so I was just excited to try my helmet on the other day. So I'm just ready to go all around.